Hi and hello everyone and welcome back to our EU4 series featuring myself, Berg787, Torio and Grey Hunter. Hello. Hello. There you go. So we left it on a quite an exciting, well, I, on my side anyway, it's quite an exciting end. Uh, me going to war, France calling me in in this big war over here. You guys? I'm almost done sieging everything Burgundy has. I can um, unpause though, right? Sorry. Yeah, so you can. I will probably pause sure. soon just to um, sign a peace treaty, but it will be very brief because I, I know what I want. Okay, now. And for me, Ravensburg was like... Hey, we don't oh, like you very okay. much. Never mind. I don't. I don't have a diplomat. Naturally, where the hell are they? Oh, they're right there. So wait, How what exactly happened with me? you then? So Ravensburg entered that war, or what? Uh, no, they didn't enter the war. They entered an alliance with the Palatinate. But okay. They seemed to be making moves in my direction. They gave you the eyes, did they? They were like. They did. They they gave me the uh, the salt eye. Yeah. You know, like, the the me and you were going at it, Burr. Tonight, you. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, what tonight, would you mean? there would, will be mortal combat. What would you mean tonight, me? Did anyone else hear that? And everyone's like, what? No one else heard anything. And he's just I eyeball. Didn't really get it, but... Okay, what are you doing, by the way? You I the am... Um, Don't worry a... about our jokes. You just worry about your... I'm signing a peace treaty, and I can't decide if I want to keep England happy or not. Let's keep England happy. I'll give them Picardy. Why? You broke your alliance with them. Mm. Do you point. need to keep them happy? No, I don't. Mm. Why okay. would you give them Picardy? Because otherwise they will hate me for not giving them Picardy, and they might become... I will uh, say, I've never had anyone hate me for not giving them land and all. Because they have sieged it themselves, and it's their, their core or claim. That's how it works. Does it cost you very much to give That's it to cool. them? As like not much. I can, I can do it. If you're giving it, what are you not getting for giving it, if you know what I mean? Um, I could only get more money or release something, because I, I am already getting everything I want. Oh, well, there you go, then. That's not really a big issue, then. Okay. Then you might as well do it. I'm pausing. Yeah, if it's not if it's not actually stopping you from getting something that you really need, then you might. Yeah, precisely. It's like, well, why yeah. not? It's, al it's almost not like you actually are being an arsehole. They're not giving it. It's like, <laughs> so, well, I could do it. But I'm, uh, just... I'm so tempted to assault into the Palatinate, but they've got that leader with five don't shock. Do it. I don't know, man. Do what you want, but remember, don't bite off more than you can chew. Well, that's why I'm not. <laughs> that's doing what it. killed Miggy in the last campaign. Well, not, not killed. Like, I want to, but I'm not going to, because I know that that's such a risky move that it will screw me entirely if I do it. You know what happens when you choke, and we're all too far away to perform the Heimlich. Yep. There and they're go. building more units, those bastards. And it's going to be really awkward having you just be silent for 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, my country's kind of been kicked out of the game. Yeah. I'm going to do I... Mathis, I'm going to join back in as someone else, and uh, <laughs> everything's going to be all right. I was, Who should I, was, I come back as? Austria? Yeah, that sounds all right. Austria sounds fantastic, yeah. Sorry, go on, Toriel. I was close to actually trying that when I got beat up as Tuscany in my game with Lord Marvel and Artanex. Um, I basically vassalized the Pope and everybody ganged up on me for that, and I was down to two provinces. Mm. Which basically probably cost me the game because it set me back about 30 years, maybe 20. But uh, that's all in the past. It's incidentally, right? <laughs> vassalized the Pope once. Remember in the, uh, in the last game, uh, last episode, rather, where I was like, ah, I can keep my fleet out there, it's fine, there'll be no problems. Yeah, my fleet's gone. <laughs> oh. <laughs> There's only two ships, it's not that big a deal. It'll be fine, Naples and Aragon will protect me, he said. Yeah, admin level four. Eat that, primitives. <laughs> primitives. <laughs> you primitives, you don't even have temples. Do what you? Kind of... Maybe I don't want temples. Yeah, I can build a temple. Yeah, I'm an that's... atheist state. Oh, all right. Well, well, maybe you don't want temples then, yeah. Maybe that's true. Maybe I don't. But, but you know what I would like? Look at you stupid <laughs> savages, man, with your, with your monarchs and your non-religion. Like, what the hell is this jazz? Crazy. Well, you see, we're time travelers from the future, where there's rational thought, and monarchies aren't always terrible things. I don't know. I thought in the future people like let monarchies less than they did in um, 1450. Speak, speak for yourself. I'm going to be a republic soon. <laughs> there you go. In your face, Grey Hunter. <laughs> Almost called well, you a wolf. <laughs> <laughs> I have to keep my, you know, I have to keep my monarchical traditions. The Great Line. Who is, what is your line, by the way? Like, who? Your royal line? What? Your pedigree? What, dynasty? Your dynasty, that's what I meant, yeah. Oh, I suppose uh, I my one. Country and find out. Von Wittelsbach, I believe. Von Wittelsbach, it is as well. Yeah. 
Sounds like if you pronounce it, like... it if you pronounce it Wittelsbach, it will be less silly. Oh, in your face. Well, I pronounce it the way I like to pronounce it. So no. Nah. He can pronounce uh, it however the hell he wants. What is mine? I can pronounce what I want to, and I can leave my friends behind because my friends don't pronounce the things you know the same way I do. Then they're no friends of yours. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or of mine. But, you know, I was talking about you, so it would have been weird if I'd said mine. <laughs> <laughs> you got the point there. Torio, did Ooh, you know what song that was? No. It's called Safety Dance. Oh, different culture. Amazing. Again. By Men Without Hats. Men Without Hats? Have you ever seen Men Without Hats? I've seen many men without hats, but none of them expressively but, named but themselves never, Men Without Hats. Never as a group. Yes. <laughs> Without I've never hats. seen a group of men without hats. No. Well, I have seen technically. Hang on. Would be... Pause for a second. We'll go oh. and pause it. <laughs> not, not as a group of men who identified themselves no. by yes. not wearing hats. Yes, that was their spiel. That was their stick. Shtick. Mm. Rather not stick. That was their stick. The yeah. stick. <laughs> stick. Yeah. <laughs> you, do you just have, if you're pronouncing that word, do you just have to sound like Sean Connery for a minute? The stick. Stick. Ah. The stick. Ah, von Wittelsberg. We meet again. <laughs> Why is it that all of my accents sound the same? Pour me a drink, you bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't it be great, really chauvinistic, chauvinistic James Bond? Ah, Miss Money Penny, you slag. Come over here and shit on Daddy's leg. <laughs> you say that like he wasn't the most chauvinistic spy ever. No, but yeah, but he was in a different way. It was a different time. It was kind of like they didn't look at it as chauvinism back then. Ah, fair enough. It was viewed as man being man. Do you know what I mean? Like. True. Not, I'm not saying I agree with that. I'm just saying that's what it was viewed as. I can't help what people view things as, can I? Society is that's society. True. So, so on as back, a free will you give city, me all of the money ever? If there's a Pretty free please. city in the empire, uh, I don't remember the new changes. Does it mean that the emperor will always uh, protect them? They will, yeah. But um, yes. that was some loud clicking, whoever that was. Was it you? I'm sorry. Money? Is that, no, I mean, that, no, it doesn't, didn't bother me that much. It was just like, give me money, click, 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 click. Pretty much. Uh, like, you can, you can shift click, then it goes to maximum. That was I suppose so. Hang on, I just have to pause for a second, because suddenly people want to be my friend, because I'm not at war with everyone. Now you got to do the quick, like, okay, so if I friend you... Mm -hmm. Memigan, where are you? I have oh, a free deploy relation. So. Who should we befriend? Fair enough. And Wurzburg, where are you hanging out? That's a point. I think I've got a free Diplo relation. Oh, shit. Sure. I know I'm over it, but that's oh. because I've got... Wurzburg, yes. welcome to the team. Thank you very much. Someone shout. Hey! Yeah. Right. That? No, that is my mother sneezing, because apparently it can't be done quietly. So oh. right, don't. It happens. Ooh. Sorry, you've Hello. not coughed in a while. Uh, yeah, I, I'm feeling better now. Expelled all that demon air. Yes. <laughs> Be gone! <laughs> I'm actually considering if I should fight anybody or not, because um, I have quite a bit of aggressive expansion. If I keep fighting, I might get, might get a coalition, which is very dangerous. But on the other hand, uh, I remember what Utrecht did before, and I don't trust them. So maybe it would be a good moment to <laughs> wipe them off the face of the earth. In that alternate universe, yeah. I was just, you know what? It's always great when you're in a war and then like you've been in it for a while and then you're like, what are we actually fighting for? I kind of remember. Oh, that's right. Take I have no idea. We're trying to take the board and we've got it sieged and everything's good. Also, um, is anybody doing anything while this is paused? Because I'm done. When you pause, you you unpause when you're yeah. done. We will do. Yeah, I just want whatever. to check that. No, 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 no. The rule is, if you've paused it, then you unpause it, and if we need to pause it again, then we either say something beforehand, or right. you know what? Like that's mm -hmm. that's that's the works for me. That's the etiquette and protocol. Okay. The etiquette and protocol. I see. Etiquette and protocol. Demand of unlawful exactly. territory from Austria because naturally. What Ooh, do you want? Ouch. No. Declining will have the following effect. You know what? I like to live dangerously. If Austria attacks me, I guess they can have it back. <laughs> they might have everything else back as well. I, I guess. You know, I mean, if you oh, really want to... What? If you want to they fuck didn't even out, fight me for it. Fight they me. just took it back. You accept it? You must have accepted it. I thought that was accept... You must have accepted. I didn't realize that you, meant you I You did a Northern back. Lion here. Oh, God okay. damn it, I did a Northern Lion. I did. There you go. <laughs> You know what bugs me about that Northern Lion? When he accepted, when he correct surrender, and then you did the exact same thing. Well done. 
Well, because it said it read like it was giving them a cast spell. No, on me, no, which it is reads. Fine. It reads there. It specifically says you will return the province. It specifically yeah. says that. It does say that. See, this is why I shouldn't be doing this late at night. <laughs> I should read better. That's okay. I should read. Actually, I wonder if that means I get the same mission back. You kept your claim. Be... That's true. I can always just fight them again. <laughs> Did you keep the aggressive expansion? No, I don't no. think so. Uh, I mean, you did keep a bit. I mean, it's only five with everybody around you. That's okay. Actually, it's better for me giving it back. How do you check... Just, how is that better for you? How, how, sorry, how do you check to see how someone else is... You know, how do you know... Where, where, did, where did you click to see Go to his... coalition map mode uh -huh. and mouse over the other countries. What's then the you will see the number. Coalition map mode. Ah, it, coalition, there we go. Yeah, right, uh, and then what, I click on his country? No, you, uh, yes, you click on the country that you want to see the aggressive expansion against and mouse over other countries. Ah, right, okay. There you go. Mm -hmm. I actually look, mm, I added the coalition map mode to my prim primary modes because it's very, very useful. Mm, it is. It is indeed. Okay, Antwerpen is now cored. Perfect. Oh, I can add it to the Empire. Do I want to? Don't know, do, do you? Be part of the Empire. The glorious Empire. No idea. Would it actually give any bonuses to the province? I don't think so. Got it. It would make <laughs> Austria like me more, but they are already at 185 relations with me. Austria will like me more. Eh. Yeah, I'm not really sure if I really care about them liking me more. <laughs> <laughs> I have pretty good allies. I have Austria and Castile. Right. I'm also thinking of investing in Poland because um, Poland has been buffed significantly. Yeah, they did. Uh, are mine, but later on in the game, not as good. Especially if Lithuania aren't part of them. Oh yeah, that's that's very necessary. But there's one Polish decision. Um, they had the form Union decision and the form Commonwealth decision. They're both pretty good. But they added one more. If you have Danz uh, Danzig, or properly Gdańsk, the Polish name, um, or... Properly, getting some nationalism in there. Yeah. Because this is a Polish province now. I actually went to high school there. I mean, in this region. When you say now, do you mean like since the war? Or like yes, okay. before the war, it was a free city, so, more, so, more or less. So, 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 so stolen land. Yeah. Okay. Keep going. <laughs> <clears throat> you need to have uh, either Gdańsk or Prague or Vienna, yeah. and you need to be admin tech ten and be at peace and plus one stability and such. Then you can click the button and automatically westernize without spending any points. All right. Okay. Pretty kind of useful. Yeah, because uh, Poland or the Commonwealth was actually pretty advanced technologically. Um, the Polish Hussars um, or Husaria um, was the best heavy cavalry in Europe. Then what happened? Then the nobles got too much power and broke the country from within. Also, we had a very good and strong king who was unfortunately very religious, the one who defeated the Ottomans at Vienna. Yes, I know. Petr Zrinski. Um, Sobieski, actually. So, was yeah, Jan king. Sobieski. Sorry, that's who I was thinking mm -hmm. of. <laughs> no, I was. No, I got his, his name's Jan Sobieski, right? Jan. Yeah. Jan, Jan, yes. Yeah, yes. there you go. See, I knew what I was talking about. Just mixed them up. And he could, actually, he could have used this victory to even take over Austria if he wanted to. But um, it's a bit silly. Or he to wasn't... expel the nobles. I mean, not expel the nobles, but uh, wrest control from the nobles um, and... Um, controlled the country properly, but instead he went for religious stuff, which was a mistake. And then Poland slowly fell apart. I mean, I'm not an expert in history. I might be doing... Telling, telling, <laughs> I might be telling this wrong. But to the best of your knowledge, that's what To the best of my knowledge, that's, that's what That's fine. Happened. I think that's all that really is expected. You know, as long as you think that you're telling it correctly, that's fine. You know, you might be wrong, mm -hmm. but... You're not, you're not like deliberately selling propaganda here that you know is like, you know, if I tell a lie enough times, it becomes true. Mm -hmm. you know? Old Joseph Goebbels style, you know? Or should I say Dr. Joseph Goebbels? Doctor. Doctor. Huh. Cocktor. Doctor Proctor. Decisions, decisions. To declare war on Augsburg or not? Well, you are fighting somebody already, right? Yeah, but I'm not really doing anything with it. I just honored the alliance because reasons. Mm. 
They're not actually coming after me. Because they can't get to me reasons. because Ulm is right there. I don't believe your reasons. You know what? Hell with it. I like to live dangerously. Let's fight. You just declaring war willy nilly, man. Don't you? You don't really have any good. I'm allies. usually more cautious, but I'm like, eh, whatever. I don't know, man. It's his country. He can do what he wants, but. Yeah, but uh, I'm just. Uh, <laughs> I'm just baffled by aggressiveness. Yeah, I mean, I agree with you. I think he's a bit crazy as well, Toriel, but, you know, hey ho, whatever. Well, I did it because this particular person doesn't have any allies, and I had two who were willing to join me with it. Well, so. that changes things a bit. David, too. I mean, I could have left them alone, but... Oh, they don't even have a fort. That's no, gonna be quick. That, that's why I said, I'll poke them. Poke them in the eye. And I'll know this time that when Austria says, hey, give that back, you say, no, <laughs> it's not a K, it's not a CB on you, it's you actually giving it back. Lessons it back. learned. Yeah, they get the CB if you don't. What, but you're not oh, hold on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, no, with Provence. I was going to say, can we get out of this war, France? But they don't seem to want to get out of it. I mean, you've got what you've came for. France, please stop. Please, well, I don't really need them to be out of the war. It's just that once they're out of the war, then I can start concentrating on other stuff. Provence uh, um, rivaled me. Yeah, they just got pieced out. Why? Why did they do that? Do they actually have anything near you? No. Or is it just because you're around? Is Milan going to take Luca? Or Lucha, rather, I should say. Hmm. Looks like it, eh? They do have a claim. Maybe I should be fabricating some fucking claims, eh? <laughs> be a good idea, wouldn't it, Berg? Fabricate some Fabricate claims. Fabricate claims, gain lands. Yeah, you know, instead of just being just being France's call boy, you know, like, oh, okay, I'll come to war. <laughs> All right, I'll All help right. you out. I'll help you out, yeah, sure. I've got nothing better to do. What was that, France? I was just thinking to myself, what should I do? <laughs> Oh, is that France? Yeah, of course. Oh, well, uh, yes. Thank you, Venice. Yes, I will ally you. Cool. All right. Oh, Hansa is actually sieging Utrecht. Oh, not John Hansa. Really? For some reason. And I want Utrecht for myself. So I do. I've got my four relations. So Siena, Mantua, France. Oldenburg, France. Pomerania, and the Hansa. I wonder what they're fighting for. <laughs> what are we fighting for? <laughs> Can I take on Gallery, Why can't we Friesland be French? <laughs> Show must go on, man. Oh, this. Wow, Portugal's getting stomped. It's great. Good stuff. Keep Who stomping. started the war? What war are you talking about? There's a lot. The one that um, that Torio was looking at. Is it's he just watching one, a war? No one. He's voyeuring a war. Utrecht. Who started the war there? Well, Utrecht are the defender against Oldenburg, so... I'm guessing yeah. Oldenburg oh. started the war. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Oldenburg in conquest of Osnabrück? No, I can't be right. Whatever it is, they're attacking. Where is Osnabrück? Isn't that near you? Well, yeah, it's closer Baden to me than it is to Utrecht. Baden What's going on in Ulm? There's a lot of, like, I can't see your land, uh, Lucas, but I can see that there's sieges going on. I can see cannon fire. You know what I mean? Like, yes. through, the, through the clouds. Mm hmm well, not the clouds, but, you know, it's not even fog, though, is it? It's just the darkness, you know, it's a little the bit... The darkness of war. <laughs> no, but you, that's what I'm saying, cause it's not really fog, because I can see the land. I just can't see the In the grim of darkness land. of yeah, Renaissance I, Europe, I can just see explosions. Way. All right, time to keep rebuilding my trade fleet. That'd be a good idea, since I've got ridiculous amounts of money. Come on, Augsburg, surrender. Gallery, hmm. Milan, just so you know, yeah, you're only renting Lucha. Yeah, you're only, <laughs> only renting them. You know, it's, that's not for keeps. Don't like think it's yours forever. You're just borrowing it until I take it back off you. You have to give that back. Yeah, you have to give that back. I'm lending it to you, but that's it. Just for now. Just for now. What not exactly? for reals. Which province? Lucha. It's the oh, green one, one just north uh... of me. Yeah. It's one of the new ones they put in the game. Oh, I see. What are they? Are they a republic? Yeah. Don't know. Don't know. What? They're going to be dead soon. Huh. Oh, they're like me. An oligarch republic or whatever it is. Oh, it's pretty good. It is pretty good. I do change it to... When I get the chance, there's two I can change it to. It's like mm. Noble Republic and the other one. I can't remember what the other merchant? one is. But no, it was no. Merchant. No, it wasn't Merchant. I don't think... 
It might no, have been merchant. Noble is cool because you can and enter Ministry royal is... marriages, but uh... yeah, 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 yeah. But I didn't like the the buffs that it gave me. The ones the other one it gave the other what the other one gave me was better when I changed. I don't I don't know what what. I can't remember what it is. Is there a way to check? Where do I click? Like I know I can't change government right now, but how would I click on it where, it gives, um, where you can still see? Go to the government tab, the first one. Yeah, I change government. There yeah. we go. So if I click on change government, ah, it was administrative republic. Oh. So that's what you want to go for? Well, I, I find it a little bit better. Mm -hmm. I'm just heading, sitting here and consolidating my land with the polder and fabricating claims on my neighbors. So yeah, I'm, fabri much. I'm, fab I'm doing a bit of Fabro on Romagna. Yeah. Papal Glorious. state be down. Okay, I think the, so I think the papal state discovered me as well. Did they discover me? See if you have aggressive expansion. No, don't they don't. No. Oh, hello. Yeah. Hello. Hello. All these wars are ending. None of us I'm are actually in a for... war. Well, technically I am in a war, but, you know. I'm just real. waiting for Austria to drop the hammer. Isn't this the point where they go, hey, give that back? What have you taken now, sorry? Um, are you at I war? If you are at war, oh, call it quickly and don't peace out, because they cannot demand it from you if you are at war with somebody. Yeah, I just realized that. I'm oh, just going to leave those guys. Oh, hold on, no, sorry. You siege that all by yourself. What did you take, sorry, did you say? Augsburg. Augsburg? I don't know. It's right next to all my existing mm. territory. All right, you haven't actually it's a taken one province it. minor. You're just sieging it. No, he took it. No, no, it's I next to it. Minshew. I annexed it. He was I'm four provinces, now he's five. I'm being silly, I just can't see it. Left of Minshew. Oh, right, the, the, the bottom one, yeah, like the bottom. Mm. Yeah, right, yep. I get it. If you can, if you can core it before you exit the war, Austria can do nothing. Well, that's what I'm thinking I can do because it says it'll be done in 1453, and the current war that I'm in is at negative 39 percent because the guys that I joined in on the side of are pretty bad. So I'm just going to leave them to it and swoop in mm. to save the day after I've cored. Okay. Well, cool. But that can wait till the next episode. Yes, it can. It can. can. So we're it can. But I'm very happy about this. Cool, cool, cool. So, uh, another exciting episode. I'm still in a perpetual war here that France doesn't seem to want to peace out on, but, you know, whatever. I ain't got much else to do. Fabricate some claims and all that. You boys? Um, I'm just uh, consolidating and fabricating. Cool, cool, cool. I have learned my lesson, and I will not accept when I think that it's a CB and it's actually give the land back. <laughs> yeah, do, do try not to make that mistake twice. It'd be very silly. But anyway, I'm again... sorry for judging you, Northern Lion. Now I understand your pain. Precisely. Uh, so, yeah, again, uh, if you're enjoying the series, please hit the like button. It means an awful lot to us. Check out everyone else's views if you can. And uh, we shall see you next time for episode three. Bye-bye. See ya. Au revoir.